meditation, especially for the last thing I've been doing. Um, you know that like meditation is a huge discipline and you have to put yourself in a state of mind in a certain position and everything so for me music I think I always get the same gesture I mean my studio is about like big as the half of that bench so I'm re it's a really tiny place I'm like a fish in a boko or something in a box so I think I need really this moment the space and this posture I am and with my computer and I can do music I will not be able to do music in a plane or something like that and I put myself in a state of mind so I'm starting all with the all with the lyrics or if I have an idea with the drums I quite like to to start with the drum because I'm really obsessed with some rhythmic and it's like a bit kind of your relationship with the death so I don't really I'm not thinking about that I'm just doing the music and if I end up with a series a series of track that I think it's it has a coherence together I feel it should be together but I'm not thinking about like a strategy or a commercial aspect I mean I really don't care about that and especially because yeah of course I remember like when the old style was like buying a CD you had the whole cosmos of someone when you bought the record and especially you had also the cover you had like you were buying a CD and you had a bit of the artist and now it's not the same it's like digital and the visual is a bit like diluted or 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 or, or um, hidden or, or lost in the media so we don't have that that really bone structure of, of the cosmos so I'm trying to yeah I'm just trying to in inject all that cosmos in one or two or a series or three tracks the 60s 70s it, music was always a kind of manifesto of the world I guess I feel and probably that music has a bit lost that idea because I like entertainment I really love music and dancing it's in my in my blood that's why I'm doing that night music stuff but I got the feeling that probably uh, we've missed something the last years and I would like to bring back that idea of it's not politic in music it's music talking about things uh, that matter now and I guess I had I have a little bit the feeling that music can just now save that fuck, fucked up world <laughs> we are <laughs> and I would like to bring back that idea with my label and with what we are doing with the visual with everything it has to be uh, I got a feeling it has to mean something and it, it cannot be empty anymore I did an art school so and I was a graphic design so I'm really attracted to images but I guess here and now we are s such submerged by so many images it's like fast food images and I like that idea that music now I, I consider music more in the the way you deliver music more punk like I like the role thing I like going out on the stage with my the same like the same uh, outfit I'm in the day and and just be raw and frontal and then you can deliver your your message like really you to me there is no hierarchy I like that idea that we're in the same I like that The way we consume music is totally different. It's like what I really like about internet and the way like music is 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 accessible. Is a young guy or a young girl who is like 12 years old and is looking for music. He doesn't have to go in the city and and ask for a grown up. He just go on internet and find what he likes. 
and I like that idea. Now music doesn't have any genre anymore. It's just crossover, and someone who like music will like music, punk will like hip hop, will like ghetto, will like everything. And I like that that it's no more an identity thing about one genre, but it's all crossover. <laughs> Thank you very much.